Um, I'm Charlie Garvett with Garvett Construction Company, and what you see behind us this morning is uh, a pull plan uh, called the Last Planner System that we're using on uh, um, this job to renovate and restore the old First National Bank building for uh, higher education use with Georgia Military College. And with me is uh, Elmo Harrell with Mock uh, Mechanical, who is doing the HVAC work and Tony Long with A.T. Long and Sons who is doing the uh, painting and finishes work for us. And we just want to uh, take a few minutes to let them maybe tell you firsthand about uh, this system and what they like about it that helps them or maybe what, uh, maybe, uh, what they don't like about it. But just some candid uh, comments about uh, lean construction and the use of the pool plan session. Elmo? I think it helps whenever you're planning ahead and when you fall behind. So you can see where the other people are going to be and catch up and keep up with the schedule. I like this better. Uh, there's a lot more interaction between the subs when you're actually yes. putting all this on the board. So. I'm a lot more comfortable with saying this is my schedule because I'm following everybody uh, except the floor man right. and it gives by knowing exactly what mechanical folks are going to do ahead of the sheetrock yeah. folks and then what he's going to do after me it, it's just a better interaction with this system than well, it is so with any of the other systems that I work on. See, I can bring my guys down here and show them this wall and show them where That's we have to be and where the other people are going to be, and they understand it better. They can't read that other schedule easily. That takes time to learn how to read it. One so of it the th yeah, that. one of the things we see is with a, with a five-minute huddle every morning, you can see exactly what everybody's committed to yes. do that day. It's in your face. That's right. It does help. Okay. Well, that's a, that's a brief discussion of the people that really make the schedule work on a construction project and hopefully it gives you some insight about uh, um, how the uh, lean construction pool planning method works. I'm not sure how long that's going to take to get into UBOX time. Well, you need to be sure. You got three days. You got three days. Do you have some on the next week? No, you got four floor of copper MCU. Yeah. Start Monday. Yeah. So you'll do three days on the box. Yeah, I can do the wall box. And, and then you got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Uh, next by next Wednesday, you'll have the four floor MCU done. I should. Okay. And then we're showing, and at the same time, you got that roof copper work on. Mm -hmm. And then on next Thursday, you'll start the third, third floor wall units. Yep. Yeah. And then you got. Three days on them. Three days on the MCU. You got three days on MCU, and then you got a fourth floor MCU copper hanging there. I don't know how to put that over there. All right, I'll put this. Yeah, I'll throw it away. Uh, I'm trying to steal the day. I don't know. <laughs> All right, so I'm giving him enough day to get it in. All right, so this week, finish it up. You got a basement copper wall installed. Next week, you do an MCU on the floor. You'll do the roof copper. You got third floor wall units start. Mm -hmm. so next week you'll be back on the third floor wall units and you'll be on the third floor MCUs. Yep. Is that it for that week? I don't know yet. You can't do that much. Uh, he's got three. Got three. Oh. <laughs> Two and a half. Two and a half. I tell, I just let him do his most of the time. <laughs>
down in the top right, you gotta turn those to school. You got all the main bases. Most of the ministry. No work on Saturday? No. I'll say no. I'll start arguing over there. Not from Cam. I got to move it to you. What can you do, John? I'll start here. What's that? I'll say you want to say Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll start. Finish hanging. It's a Wednesday. I think it's our money. We got it ready. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you. All right. Uh, give me a week, a couple of days of it. However long you think it's going to take you to punch those out. Columns on the ground floor, sand, sand. Columns on the ground floor. You have to finish some sand in. And they're working now. Okay, they're working on that now. So that would that would work with me going in next week. Okay, because I got plenty of flash to work on this dry. And a lot of sheet rock. It's already I think I think one more week of what? I mean, how I can do this year. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to do some ground first. Yeah, okay. We're going to do some stickers. You know what? I'm through. I ain't got any more stickers, so I quit. I mean, <laughs> I'll make sure you got something by next week. <laughs>